Shrivastav and couple of months ago I wrote a script which can let you download music of any kind from the web so it's really interesting let me show you a demo how it works so I'm in the music directory and so I can just uh, start the script by just typing the name of the script and then I can just type in the name of the song Viva Vida by Coldplay and I just hit enter key and it's uh, downloading the song which is really cool in, in about 30 seconds I'll have that song so uh, let me show you how to set it up first go to this link uh, github.com slash yask123 slash auto music downloader I leave this link in the description below so uh, some prerequisites uh, it uh, needs mac os x or linux it can even run on windows uh, it needs python 2.7 which is uh, pre-installed on mac os x as well as on linux so you don't have to worry about it on windows you'll have to install python you can, go, you can google download python and go to their website and download it and then you need pip uh, without pip this will not run because I'm using pip to install the dependencies uh, so you need pip so pip is not pre-installed so you'll have to go to terminal and then ok so we have the music downloaded we'll look into that but before that let me show you how to install pip so type sudo easy in installer pip and hit enter and you'll we'll have it downloaded but since I already have it I won't do it ok fine so as you can see the song has been downloaded so let's go and check it out awesome so it's running fine it's great so let me get back to the instructions on how to set it up so once you have all of these three things so uh, setting it up is very easy all you have to do is type this command and that's all it's, uh, so okay, fine. So I have this downloaded already uh, go to this directory and just type python super installer and hit enter and what it will do is automatically install all the dependencies it needs firstly it will install uh, youtube dl actually the, depend the dependencies are listed in requirements.txt file which it will read from here and the youtube dl it will install that and then it does a very interesting thing it goes to the home directory and then it creates a new folder in your home directory which is called dot music underscore downloader and then it will copy that the script from the current path to that folder and then it will create a path uh, variable of that folder so the interesting thing is I mean it's really awesome because now you can go to any directory you want to and you can start the script from there I mean you don't have to have uh, the script in that particular directory where you want to run it from so you can go to any directory you want to and since that script has been added as a path variable so you can start that script from anywhere and that's actually what I did I went to the music uh, directory here I did CD music and the script is not actually in CD music let me show you if I type ls I don't have the script in this directory at all but I can start the script from anywhere and boom all I have to do is just type in the name of the song and it will download it for me just a quick uh, overview of what is happening in this script I mean how does it work you must be curious so what I did was I uh, I take in the query of the song that you just typed the name of the song and then it sends a get request to youtube.com so actually I'm, I'm taking the music from youtube and it sends a get request to youtube.com 
and then it uh, matches the best result and then it grabs the music video link of the best match result and with the help of YouTube DL I'm able to download that song okay. so just another thing I would like to uh, tell you another thing is that if you get this error this means that FF probe or AV probe is not installed 